This is the Shenandoah State Park in Virginia. I'm trying out a mountain bike with 29 inch wheels and a motor. And I'm learning that this motor is not very good for climbing these hills. But I'm gonna do it anyways and see how it goes. All right, I'm gonna take the Allen's Mountain Trail. I'm gonna take a right, I gotta get a running start, that's steep. Oh, my brakes. Spike. Spike is too tall. Here we go. That's too steep. Jeez. I'm in the right gear. This motor does not have the strength. I just said this was an easy trail. It's just steep. Oh, torquey gear. I don't know. This is not a torquey gear. This wheel is just too, too big. 29er. Too steep. Definitely can't take Sophie on this one. <sighs> this one's marked blue. Okay, let's try one more hill. Maybe I have to up the power. No, it is giving me max power. <sighs> it's just the wheels are too big. Big wheels are absorbing all these bumps real well, though. Without a, it's a hard tail. There's no rear shock. I need to change the brake fluid. Now oh, the front brake's not working, but the rear brake's working. Keep switching back and forth. I have got to put the smaller wheel back on. I'm gonna burn up this thing. I'm turning the camera off until something interesting shows up. So it turns out we're on Allen's Mountain Trail, and this is pretty rough. It's ups and downs and ups and downs. So I'm checking to see if this thing's getting hot. The, the BMS is not feeling hot anywhere at all. The batteries are just slightly warm, slightly. I gotta get, no, it doesn't matter. I just need to get a smaller motor. A smaller motor, I mean a smaller wheel. This, this is a failure. This is only good for street, these big tires. The campsites are interesting. You park over there, then you walk in, and they give you wagons to pull your stuff. Oh, shoot. And it's slippery here. <laughs> I fell over. That was fun. 
Maybe I should walk the bike. <sighs> so what was I saying? The campsites look nice. Let's just take a look at an unoccupied one. Must be for the trash. Let's see what this is. Firewood. Pretty cool firewood box. Nice pads. A place to hang your food, I guess. Although I think a bear could reach that. Yeah, it says there's bears. Oh, there's a walking path along the river. That's what I was looking for. There's a bike path along the river. This is probably bike walking only, I'm not sure. But yeah, there's the river. This part of the river is really wide too. I gotta find out if we can bike here. Yort? There's yorts here. Huh. Yort. Looks like it's occupied. I've gotta check this. Primitive camping. Oh, there's a primitive camping spot right here. This is cool. Although I don't think we could make it back if we go down river on the boats. But a nice walkway so you can drop off your canoe. River's moving. All right, we're just gonna give this a try. The Cottonwood Trail Campground Access. Water access. Okay, let's go. Finally found the river trail. It does say bikes are allowed on this one. I think that's a sign that says that. Oh, this can be slippery. That's how I fell. Wooden bridges. So wet. This trail is so much nicer than that mountain trail. Go oh, jump. This is what I was looking for, for Sophie to ride with me. The river is still next to me. We're still on cotton, whoa, what cottonwood trail. Okay, there's deck. This stuff I've crashed so bad on before. I'm gonna test it. Yeah, it's a little slippery, but it looks like it's made of the better material. What's this? Point, oh yeah, point trail goes like straight up, so forget that. <laughs> Cool. Wild Cat Ledge Trail. Yeah, this is the better material. So it should be less slippery, but still. Looks so dangerous. Yeah, I locked up my e rear wheel easily with a hop. I can see myself trying to take this turn quick and just flying off into that. This is awesome. Sophie's gonna love it. Gotta bring Lucy here too. This thing should be speed limited to 20. Let's test it. Yeah, it's very weak. It's using 300 watts. That's it. It's limited to 18 miles an hour. That's the problem with these cheaper speed controllers. Oh, oh, look at that. It's like a meadow. 
Wow. I wonder if I can ride. Oh my god. Uh, it's got a barbed wire. Must be somebody's farm. Look at that. That's cool. Better to restart the Okay, yeah, we found a big meadow-looking thing here next to the river, but it says, that little white sign over there says private property. Let's keep going. Meadow or a field, I don't know. Looks like we're going back. So that's the end, I guess. This is what this gigantic wheel is made for, the 29er motored wheel. Otherwise, you're just going to burn it up. It looks like what burns up is the wires and um, the, the hub. The speed controller wasn't feeling hot, but it is like, mounted externally. faster it would be stupid you get paralyzed Ow. Yeah, I'm gonna keep to the right try to follow the river River's next to me. About 20 feet to my right. Ah, wood. Danger. I do pedal. To get up those little hills. The bathroom to my left. Water. I saw a water spigot. Now we're getting the trails mapped out good. I'll know where to take Lucy. Check this trail. I don't see any signs saying don't go in. Campgrounds. Looks like it's a campground loop. Number two campground. Another good thing that we looked. Look what we found here. Another launch site. This is closer to the parking. Now, of course, you got to be camping here to be able to use this, I'm sure. Oh, my. I could see us sliding all the way down into that. All that wet wood. 
It's pretty cool. So the walking trail that goes along where the tents are at, you have to be able to jump that. And then there's those TP tent looking things. I don't want to get too close. I don't want to spook the horse. So yeah, the horse got spooked by a ball. A walnut. I'm going to back off. A walnut scared it, I think. But I can't, the, ho the horse is looking back at me. I don't want to scare it. Oh, it's closed. That's another boat launch. This one's closed. Because it's flooded. River's really flooded, but this is another boat launch. We'll have to compare this video to a future video to see how much it really is flooded. So this is the Shenandoah River that State view. Park, a 20 minute drive from Front Royal, Virginia. I'll put up another video in about a week to see what this place looks like after the water has receded. It's almost up to this trail right here next to us.